Hi, I'm Ward Blackwell. Welcome to Front Street 411. Pennsylvania's dental meeting, aka the PDM, was just a couple of weeks ago. That was closely followed by Cinco de Mayo and Mother's Day. With a few weeks to go before Memorial Day, the pace is slow just a bit here at PDA, kind of in between all these events. So it seems like a good time to catch up on some things. First off, a report from the last PDA board meeting. Among other things, the PDA board decided to donate the remaining KN95 masks that were left over from the fit testing program of two years ago. Um, invest in technology to expand our hybrid meeting capability, to continue the Leadership Academy for at least one more year, to form an ethics task force, to open up more opportunities for PDA members to serve as delegates to the ADA House of Delegates, and to ensure unofficial minutes of board meetings are quickly posted to the PDA website for viewing by members. The board also voted to have PDA join more than 115 other dental organizations as part of the Coalition for Modernization of Dental Licensure. The coalition was founded four years ago by IDEA and ASDA and supports ensuring patient safety, increasing access to care, and promoting professional mobility by modernizing the dental licensure process. PDA will be the 17th member of the coalition that is a state dental association, and that happens to include our neighbors in Maryland and Ohio. Now, one last board action of note was to advance a proposal to change PDA bylaws to make a representative of the new dentist committee a voting member of the PDA board. Now, before this can become final, the PDA bylaws committee will need to draft specific language for the board to formally adopt as a bylaws change. But that should still mean new dentists will be ensured a voice on the board very soon. Now, those of you who contribute to the PDA Foundation may be interested to know that the Foundation helps support Mom and PA. And those of you that use our PDA Go app are undoubtedly aware that PDA has also been spreading the word about the need for volunteers at the Mom and PA next month in York. So sign up if you're at all interested in information on the screen. And PDA support for the work of dental-related charities extends to our helping to secure a gubernatorial proclamation recognizing the Dental Lifeline Network for several milestones, including $20 million of care donated here in Pennsylvania. Finally, I'd like to mention that the Pennsylvania Coalition for Oral Health, which also receives support from the PDA Foundation, is partnering with PDA member Dr. Sean Boynes to conduct a webinar on May 23rd that will take a unique look at issues relating to the treatment of individuals with disabilities. The webinar is free, but registration is required. Just look for the link in the PDA Go app. Well, that's it for this time. Sure wish there was some kind of holiday between Mother's Day and Memorial Day. I've got it. Happy National Barbecue Day.